Quantum is the only tool we have to understand the complexity of nature at the level of atoms and molecules. So, why does this matter to governments and big institutions? Imagine a game of chess. If you were to use a traditional computer to win, the computer would try to predict every possible move from your opponent one by one. This takes a considerable amount of time. But if you were to use a quantum computer, it would evaluate all the possible moves simultaneously in a fraction of the time. If we can understand this kind of complexity in the behavior of a molecule, for example, we could think of designing new materials like more efficient batteries or cheaper microprocessors, or even help scientists create new vaccines and medicines. Imagine computing as a way to get from one place to another, like driving a car from point A to point B. In traditional computing, the more powerful your computer is, the faster you would get to your destination. But with quantum computing, the faster route could be a different and unexplored one. So what's the EU doing about it? The European Commission wants Europe to become a quantum leader. They've put together a strategy based on five main pillars. Research and innovation. Europe already has a strong background in quantum science. To keep that momentum going, the EU is launching a big initiative with member states. The idea is to fund research and help turn discoveries into real-world applications. Infrastructure. We're talking about investing in quantum simulators, expanding Europe's own quantum computers, creating the first secure communication network linking space and Earth, and starting a pilot for a European quantum internet. This is all about building the tools and spaces needed to develop quantum technology. A strong ecosystem. That means securing supply chains of components and supporting the development of real, usable products, like quantum AI processors for medical diagnostics or smart energy grids. Europe wants to give a boost to startups and growing companies working on quantum tech. Security and defense. EU satellites like Galileo and IRIS-2 will be upgraded with new technologies like extra-accurate clocks for geolocalization and secure communications using quantum encrypting methods. Quantum tech is also important for keeping Europe safe, especially in areas like space and cybersecurity. Skills. All of this needs skilled people. The first Quantum Skills Academy will be launching soon, and competitions and awards to help people grow in this field will be rolled out in the coming months. So the EU is investing in education and training. This is just the beginning. The EU is working to turn the strategy into reality. The goal? To make Europe a quantum powerhouse by 2030, bringing together brilliant minds, strong industries, and world-class research. Was this interesting to you? Click subscribe and let us know what you think in the comments.